Hi guys! Today we'll make a cool new multi-level maze for our hamster. It will be a five-level hospital. So Ginger can mix business with pleasure. Right. First, we need to cut several cardboard bases for our maze. So, do you realize that Ginger is an experienced maze walk... a uh, maze runner? Anyway, we should do our best to surprise him. Sure, Sammy, but it depends on you as well. And guys, be careful with the cutter. I made a hole for Ginger here. Good! One part of the base is ready. Keep it up! Why only one? All five are ready. Here, look. Wow. When did you do all this? I got distracted again. <laughs> Can you make the decor? Sure. We'll have two types of walls. Small decorative walls and these large high walls in hospital style. Check it out. So I decorated all the base parts. Let's admire them. I mean, check them out. Also, I made a layout of all the obstacles. Yes, Sam, I must admit that decorating is the only thing you're better at than eating sweets. Right, Sue, decor and sweets are two out of three most important things in my life. Uh, decor, sweets, what's the third thing? Guys, any ideas? Making our viewers happy, of course! While the viewers make me happy giving a thumbs up to our videos. Sammy, look, all the maze faces are ready! That's what I call a quick building construction. Well, now we can move on to making the obstacles. So guys, let's begin arranging the obstacles. We'll start with the top level. First, we'll place all the separation walls and then the obstacles. Guys, remember to be very careful working with the hot glue gun. Here, we'll have a dining area. Did you say dining area? Yes, we'll not just have tables and chairs, but lots of fun stuff. Huh, I'll be right back. Oh, where are you going? Anyway... Glue the walls, leaving space between them for future obstacles. There. We'll make a small separation in the shape of a cheese here. Remember that your pet should be able to pass between the walls. Let's begin arranging the details. Tables and chairs go first. One goes here. Yeah, Sue, you're a pro in arranging things quickly. But now, watch me! Cool obstacles, Sammy. So bright. Ginger will definitely like them. Let's add a door as well. Right here. And this is a cool tunnel. Done. Since we're talking about tunnels... Cool, Sammy. Transparent tunnels always look awesome. What's this holy blanket? Why do we need it in the hospital? Oh, and that's not a blanket. That's a rope bridge. Let me show you. Huh? Done. Wow, why a cool dining area. What's next? You'll see. We put these cylinders everywhere to make it easier for the hamster to pass between the levels. Right, we don't want him to hurt himself. Oh, I can see you brought the first obstacle. Let's place it here. Two, you still didn't tell us what this level is. Ah, the surgery and treatment room. Even the tunnel fits the theme. <laughs> but... To make it more fun... Whoa, cool! Continuing with the treatment theme, we'll make a bandage obstacle. Attach the bandage diagonally like you do with shoelaces. Ginger's gotta be the healthiest hamster in the world after a training like this. Yes, Sammy, physical training is very important for health. Especially for hamsters. Phew! What is that? Oh, a virus? Don't be afraid, Sammy. We have something to confront it. But first, Ginger's gonna have to overcome a small obstacle. So, are you sure he's gonna make it? Of course, Sammy. Our hamster is an expert in overcoming stairs and slides. There, this level's ready. Here's our third level. It's made in the shape of petals. I already glued the separation walls and made these holes in them. This level looks kinda empty, don't you think? I do. That's why we're gonna do this! Spread the tinsel paper, filling all the sectors with it. This will make it a little harder for Ginger to pass. An easy level turns into a hard one. Pay attention to the cylinder. It's right here in the corner. Let's fill the floor of the third level with these little balls. Woo! <laughs> Leave the central part free. 
It's the passage to the next level. They look like breakfast cereal. <clears throat> Sammy, you just ate. Why are you always thinking about food? Yes, you sorry. I promise I won't mention food anymore. Buy the mozzarella. <laughs> I'll pretend I didn't hear that. Well, let's continue. This is the recovery level with beds and stuff. So first we'll put soft paper tinsel. These beds I made will perfectly fit this level. Yes, Sammy, just what we need. Our beds will be right here next to each other. By the way, what kind of mattresses do hamsters prefer? Hard ones or, like me, soft ones? Be careful not to fall asleep. I glued the beds and the curtains and this cute bedside table. So hospital rooms can be boring. Hmm, what do you suggest? Entertainment! <laughs> Our hospital room will even have a swing! Bravo, Sammy! Ginger will definitely relax and have fun! To catch! Huh? Got it! This slinky will make a great tunnel! Voila! What about this? This too, Sammy. Let's set it here. And this level's ready too! A real party! <laughs> Sammy, there's no time for fun yet. We've almost finished the maze, so we can party! <laughs> All right. Up. We'll set these roulettes. It'll take Ginger some effort to get past them. So, do hamsters have hospitals? <laughs> of course, they're called veterinary clinics. I hope the only hospital Ginger's gonna visit will be this maze. Guys, give a thumbs up so that Ginger stays healthy. Sammy, we only need to make a roof and the external decor. These cute bricks will be at the end of the level. We'll have a helipad on the roof. That's what I call decor. Where's this helipad? I'm gluing one of them right now. Wow, we'll have two helipads? Everything for our hamster. Well, yes. This is how a standard hospital roof looks like. I also made a small shed. Let's glue it above the hole made for Ginger. Every hospital should have a special sign. A cross. This way, everyone will know that this roof is only for hospital helicopters. Alright, I know what else this hospital's missing. Well, guys, we made our five-level hospital maze for a hamster. Sammy made this external decor. A porch, some greenery. Ah, now let's connect our levels into one hospital. This is reception. The next level is the hospital room with entertainment. The third level has petal-shaped sections. The second to last level is the surgery and treatment room. The upper level is the dining area. And our roof on top. A little warm-up for Ginger. Awesome! So we made a real hospital! I guess Ginger can't wait to see it. Then let's let him. Go, buddy! I believe in you! Look, I think he found the passage to the first level. Good job! Let's see how you do this one. Huh. <laughs> Ginger likes treats. Just like I do. He found the nuts! Time to power up! Oh, I think he wants some more! Come on, Ginger! There's so much more ahead! Oh, oh look! He found the tunnel! Yeah, he's a smart guy. But this stage is a hard one. Oh, Ginger, they're not edible. <laughs> I think he figured it out, Sammy. <laughs> Go, Ginger! Ha! 
<laughs> so he outsmarted your system. And here we go to the next level. It's the treatment and surgery department. Oh, he's gonna make the boy race. Keep the distance, Ginger. Keep your distance. Oh. That's okay, Sammy. He already passed the bandage obstacle. Oh, I'll bet he liked these slides. Wow, that's smooth. Way to go, buddy! Here comes the petals-shaped level. So, I think he's gonna take a nap here. <laughs> no, look. He found the passage to the blue sector. Oh, shoot! He'll get stuck in here! Should we help? No, Sammy. Ginger's a maze expert, remember? I'm sure he'll find his way out. That's the last soft sector, buddy. Quick, enter the hole! I guess Ginger had too many treats today, Sammy. <laughs> This level is the hospital room with some entertainment. Aw, you can have a rest here, Ginger, if you want. The path was thorny, but our brave fella kept going. He never stopped wondering what's there at the end of the road. <laughs> Sammy, you're a great storyteller. In the meantime, our brave traveler reached the passage to the last level! Here we go! You're at the finish line, Ginger! Go! Go! <gasps> Look! He's gonna enter the reception room! Way to go, Ginger! Uh, I bet these things are great to rub your belly! <laughs> Ginger! Ginger! Yay, you passed another maze, buddy! Good job! <laughs> Guys, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to see more fun things for your hamsters! Now Ginger has his hospital! Everything's under control! Thank you for watching, guys! Bye bye See ya! Well, hi there! What's up? Hey, I'm talking to you! What's wrong? Listen, if you're in a bad mood, then tell me! I understand! Hi, guys! You know what's going on with the hamster's mood? I'm starting to worry! Hmm. Uh, there is something strange about your behavior! What is wrong? Now come on, tell me! Why aren't you running in the spinning wheel? Is it Sue who doesn't allow you to? Huh? Ah, uh, I get it. You are too shy to talk in front of the camera. I'll fix it in no time. So, what do hamsters like most of all? Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. Ah, uh, uh, where was it? Ooh, this I don't need. Oh! Found it! Let's start with the carrot. Here you go. You want some? No? Ugh, whatever. Huh. Guys, what's going on here? Nothing special. We're just having a small talk here. That's weird. I heard only your voice, Sam. No, we were having fun here. You know, singing and all that. Singing? <laughs> I don't believe you. <laughs> Guys, you saw it. Sam, if you want to make friends or play with someone, you don't have to be annoying with so many questions. But I also tried to treat him with a carrot. And what do you think about this? Whoa. Sue, don't you think that this maze is way too easy? Huh, and what do you suggest? To make four more of them. Yeah, that's a good idea. Each maze will become a new level. And to make them even more beautiful, we'll use different colors. Let's hurry up and start drawing. Next maze will be a bit more complicated. Oh, Sue. I see that you know what you're going to draw. Right, Sammy. It'll be an unusual maze. Ooh, it's round. That's right. I also put something together. Look. 
Great, Sam. That's a cool maze. Right, we need two more designs. Look, maybe we can use this thing in our maze? Let's take a look. Sure. I hope that our hamster friend will fit into this thing. Okay. Guys, if you like the idea of this five-level maze, then give a thumbs up. Sam, what do you think of this fourth maze? It's totally awesome. Let's get to the construction. All right, and we'll design the red maze a bit later. Okay. Sue, Sue, come and have a look. Our friend is already testing the future maze. So friends, each maze will require cardboard bases like this. Hmm, the first maze will only require cardboard. Sam! Yes, yes, everything is almost ready. Here you go, I cut all the parts. Whoa, let's check what we have. No need to check, time to glue them. As you say, Sammy. Hmm, this maze is not as easy as it seems. But we'll see later. Don't forget to glue this. Thanks, Sammy. <laughs> Sam, you were doing a great job today. You prepared all the parts so nicely. You don't have to thank me. Just call me the master of cardboard mazes. <laughs> I'll rename you in my phone like that. Guys, our first maze is ready. I think it looks great. Of course it does, since I cut everything out. Let's get to the next one right now. And this maze will be round. You will need this. I don't think so, Sammy. <sighs> we won't need the ball at all. I'll roll the cardboard instead. According to our design, the cardboard will take a round shape here, so it shouldn't be too thick. Let's get to work. <laughs> we need to hurry up and assemble our maze because Sam is already preparing parts for the third one. Glue it nicely. I'm watching you. Whoa, I really like our round maze. Just a little bit more and it'll be ready. Why is it taking so long? I'm almost done with things for the third maze. <sighs> Oh, I really want to start the hamster run! Phew, if you didn't rush me, I would manage it faster. Don't you think so, Sammy? Guys, which maze do you like the most? The first one or the second one? <laughs> what about the third or fourth one? Very funny. They don't exist yet. Well, let's do a poll for the best maze when all five are ready. And our viewers will choose the best one. Let's do it. And they will write their choice in the comments. I guess we need to set the parts like this. Aha, uh -huh, got it. Be careful with the hedgehogs. What hedgehogs? What do you mean, what? With these ones, of course. Uh, sorry, I didn't guess right away. <laughs> How could you miss all these hedgehogs? I don't get it. Poor Sammy. Oh well, the next maze doesn't have that much cardboard. Oh, I am so looking forward to the hamster running in the maze! It'll be so much fun! So the third maze is ready! Yay! Well, there are only hedgehogs here. Brr. Okay, now we have a very interesting task, guys. You forgot something! Great, you're just in time. First, we need to divide our platform into four parts like this, using the cardboard. Eh, uh, this doesn't look much like a maze. More like some rooms in a hobbit house. Huh. But look at this cool revolving door. And the pipe. The pipe! Where do we install it? We will attach it here. Don't worry. I'm not worried. I hope the hamster will be okay with it when he sees it. So, we should come up with something for these two sections. Eh, let's leave it like this. We already have the revolving door and the pipe. That's not interesting. We should fill them at least with all kinds of bright stuff like this. Hmm, I guess it's not that easy to get out of this maze. 
And I think that this maze looks prettier than the others. Plus, more challenging. Now attention, friends. We are constructing the last maze. The fifth one. Guess which color it'll be. Correct! It'll be red! Well, here. Everything is easy peasy. Wow, it's an Italian maze! Why Italian? Uh, well, here, all the tracks look like spaghetti. They're long and curly. By the way, guys, do you have a favorite type of pasta? I like bolognese most of all. Comment below! Oh, Sam, I think you're just hungry. That's why you see spaghetti everywhere. <laughs> and is the Italian maze ready? Sure. We are a great team. Hooray! We can start the run! Five level maze. This is something brand new for our channel. Guys, give a thumbs up for our most valiant marathon runner. Ready, steady, go! I wonder how fast our hamster can make it to the finish line. Go, 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 hamster! You can do it! I believe in you! You're going to be our new super hamster champion, right? Right? Uh-huh. Oh! <laughs> Come on, you can do it! Oh, no, no, no! That's cheating. Go back a bit. He's just too clever for this. <laughs> Yay! So the first maze was quite easy. The competitor looks very confident. Guys, don't forget to comment below which of the five mazes you liked the most. Let's watch how our friend deals with the second maze. Oops, that's a dead end, sweetie. Uh, go here. Go, go, go! Yes, yes, you're doing great! Wow, that was some speed. Now the task gets harder. You can make it, friend! We're cheering for you! No worries, Sam. I'm 100% sure he will tackle it. And he did! Wow! <laughs> oh, now goes my favorite part. Sue, maybe we should help him? No, no. I control the situation. Everything is going as planned. Our hamster is super smart. Huh, he didn't like the toy so much. Oh, well. Hey, the fake grass didn't confuse him. Yay! Hooray! The last level! Amazing! I never thought it would be so breathtaking. Keep going, little one. Oh. Come on, just a few steps left. Yes. And? Almost there. <gasps> Yay! He's a champion! A real champion! Guys, did you like our five-level maze? If yes, then give a thumbs up. 